Hello guys, this is Teacher Ryan. Ngayon po pag-aaralan natin yung mga subjects or aalamin natin yung mga subjects na tinetake ng mga STEM students sa senior high school. Let's go back to basic. Okay? Uh, K-12, uh, R810-533, yung Enhanced uh, Basic Education Act po dito sa Pilipinas. May apat po tayo na tracks. Academic, meron po tayong Tech Walk, sports, saka po yung sa design. Sa academic po, nandun po yung STEM, ABM, yung saka po yung gas. Ngayon po, alamin natin, ang layon din po kasi nito is yung sa kolehiyo, sa negosyo, saka sa trabaho. So, alamin natin ngayon, mga senior high school, ano ba yung mga subject ng grade 11 at grade 12 STEM students. Okay? At ano yung mga aligned courses? Although sa mga courses naman po, depende po yun sa universities. Meron po nagpapakuha ng uh, units kung hindi talaga yun yung sila na kinuha mo ng senior high school. Pero iba pa rin po kasi yung uh, kinuha mo na ito ng uh, senior high school, yung subjects na ito, bago kang mag-college kasi, or yung strand na ito, kasi nandun na nga yung preparation. Okay po. So, grade 11, ano-ano ba yung mga subject natin sa ba STEM? Okay, so dito po sa PERSEM, meron po tayong course subjects, applied, saka specialized. So basahin po natin sa course subjects. Oral communication, communication at pananaliksik sa wika at kulturang Pilipino, earth science, general mathematics, contemporary Philippine arts from the regions, physical education and health one. Sa applied naman po, nandoon yung Empowerment Technologies, Specialized General Biology 1, Specialized, then is Pre-Calculus. Next po is sa second sem naman tayo, Core Subjects, Reading and Writing, Pagbasa at Pagsusuri ng iba't ibang teksto tungo sa pananaliksi, Statistics and Probability, 21st century literature from the Philippines and the world, physical education and health too. Up, applied naman po is practical research 1. Sa specialized naman po, general biology 2, general chemistry 1, and basic calculus. Sa grade 12 naman po, ito naman yung mga subjects nila. For subjects, we have the Disaster Readiness and Risk Reduction, Introduction to Philosophy of the Human Person, Physical Education and Health 3, Understanding Culture, Society, and Politics. Sa applied naman po, English for Academic and Professional Purposes, Entrepreneurship, Practical Research 2, General Physics 1, uh, specialized na po yun, General Chemistry 2. Sa second sem naman po nila, bago po sila gumraduate, core subjects po is Media and Information Literacy, Personality Development or Pansariling Kaunlaran, Physical Education and Health 4, applied naman po is Pilipino sa Piling Larang, Apply din, inquiries, investigation, and immersion. Specialized naman po, general physics 2, and work immersion, research, career advocacy, and culminating activities. So, kasama na po yan yung on-the-job training. So, yan po yung mga subjects sa STEM. Okay po. Ngayon, pagka-graduate mo dyan, uh, makikita naman yung online. Ano ba yung mga align courses na pwede mong kahanin. Sa Pilipinas, sa mga universities, colleges, commonly pag nasa pag STEM students ka, napaka tamir yung opportunities. Nandiyan yung pwede kang maging DOST scholar. Aside from that, ano pa ba yung, yung sa mga medical field? Nursing, dentistry, occupational therapies, uh, therapy, uh, physical therapy, nandiyan po yung radio technology, medical technologies, dentistry, Doctor of Medicine, yung psychology, uh, pwede siya dito. Depende rin po kasi yun, minsan kasi BS or what you call that, or AV Psychology. Okay? So sa engineering naman po, ang dami rin. Nandiyan yung mechanical engineering, industrial engineering, iba pa yung industrial technology, 
So, computer sciences kasama rin, civil engineering, okay? So, architecture kasi kasama sa STEM po kasi. Andiyan science, technology, engineering, and mathematics to eh. So, napakarami pong mga pwedeng matake dito. Okay? So, yun po. Um, Ipopost po na lang yung mga courses na pwede pang matik, align courses na pwede pang matik dito sa STEM. Okay, so again, this is Teacher Ryan. Maraming salamat po. Sana po nakatulong tong information na to, although binasa ko lang din naman, para magbigay sa inyo ng advanced information po. Ano ba yung mga subjects na pwede po natin matip. Okay, maraming salamat po at God bless.